How long before the show do you know that this is the plan for the breakup to happen? The whole the whole day. The whole day, uh, Jeff is like, I'm doing business, I'm to do the right thing, and then I'm going home. And I was like, Well, I'm going with you. And he was like, You don't have to go with me. Don't, don't you know, this is your career, you do so he he while I did it anyway, he the whole time was very honest with me that I did not have to do this, that this was not my fight, that all of the above, you know, and, he, and I said, I'm with you, Jeff, let's go. I didn't know what I was giving up. I didn't know what I was getting. I didn't have any idea. I just was flying by the seat of my pants and dumber than a bucket of blonde hair. Did you have any conversations with the Vins, Bruce, Pat, anyone about what was going on? We had our bags set up and we walked out of that ring and went through Gorilla and grabbed our bags and went right to the car and left. And literally, uh, we went to Jeff's dad and started drinking and got in the hot tub. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to talk about yeah, that more in a second. Let, let, let's run the clip of this match. In the pay per view opener, you defeat the 1 2 3 kid in a great match. With the crazy pile driver from yeah, the middle yeah, turnbuckle. That was, that was uh, his idea, and he called that, and I didn't feel comfortable doing it. And you can see I kind of put one foot down when yep. I did it. Now, right now we're watching those spin kicks I talked about earlier, uh, decapitate a man, and that man was me. So now one, two, and kick out. He's going to have to do more than that to beat the old road dog. Uh, takes a good man to beat me. It just don't take him long. Oh, <laughs> next drop right kick me right in the face in the, the turnbuckle. At least I didn't have anywhere to go. Um, Big scoop slam puts you in position. Says, "Stay there, dog." Yep, here we go. Climbs here up top, go. looking for a high risk maneuver. What does yeah. one, two, three kid have in mind? Big frog splash oh, connects. Frog splash. Uno dos. Not today, kiddo bambito. Is that Donald Trump, the the referee? <laughs> oh no, that's Jack Doan. Had, like, look, from the back, he looked like he had a comb. Had over. the hair. Oh yeah. <laughs> Kid goes for the Rana. You counter with the sit out power bomb. Yeah, yeah. I thought our timing looked really good on that too. Yep. Um, but yeah, th this was a great match. There was only one spot where we weren't uh, simpatico mm -hmm. mentally, um, and it it didn't get. You couldn't really tell anything was going on. But uh, I don't know. You might could, but but uh, me and him could anyway. Back kid into the corner right there. Irish whip him off. Pillar to post across to the other side. And there you have your shoulder oh, connecting the with, the, with the post. I don't even know about buckle. You ate the post, dog. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're right. I did eat the buckle post. Kid climbing up again. I, don't, I, didn't know how to, I didn't know how to do that. I should have just fell on the top rope. You know what I mean? I never <laughs> I didn't know how to. physically pulled his <laughs> yes, leg like off pulled of pulled him off of there. And see and how one, oh, my goodness. See how one foot went down first? Yep. Like it was, I was just scared to do it. And he was like, no, no, it's going to be awesome. And you're going to beat me. And, and I was like, I don't know, man. And, and we've talked about that a hundred times since. Like he wanted, to, he wanted that done. And so that's what we did. There's certain moves when you're in those positions where it seems like it should be simple. Just step back and drop. Take, yeah, take yeah. clean bumps to your butt, whatever. Yeah, I, yeah. I remember the first time having someone up in the fireman's on the second to do Finley's roll through. And I'm just up there. I'm like, I can't do this. Yeah, this is yeah, scaring yeah, yeah. me. And it's very right simple. <laughs> and I should be able to do it. And like, I have the skill to do so. But like mentally, a block right there. Oh, Lord. I'm a swell dancer, too. You, you got some have, moves, I got dog. some mizzoves. So it's amazing Kid would actually call for that spot after coming back from a neck injury. We yeah, talked but about look, that. He, he, he trusted me, and he said he's not going to hurt, and, and he didn't get hurt, and thank God he didn't because I didn't know what I was doing. Uh, but we worked together, and we talked about it. We figured it out. We did it. You know what I mean? Um, so, yep. So after this match, we also have another big moment because we have Jeff getting to sing with my baby oh, tonight so, in the so live yeah. performance. So, so yeah. So this was look. This was a big night for us. This is uh, great. If we can get audio right here. Oh, he's back up on the stage. What's he doing? Checking things out. I think the kid is being assisted. Mike, back check. Back in the locker room. <laughs> One, two. And the kid is going to be all right. Just finish the big match and then to come up for the mic check. The yeah. I made sure the stuff was plugged in correctly there. Lawler okay. putting you, putting you yeah. over, putting over yeah. the gimmick. Yeah, look, that was a great – it's the perfect night for a young man's career and what he should do at the end of it is quit. <laughs> what the world? 
when I just you were beat t- kid, I yeah, just beat one, two, three. You got, a, kid. you got an extra segment. Uh, yeah, on the pay per view, I did the singing thing or the singing thing with Jeff. Then we had the Intercontinental Title match that I'm sure we're going to get to here in just a moment. But what a big night for us! And in retrospect, looking back, man, it was just you know. Just uh, error and judgment, and believe you me, it wasn't the first one, and it wasn't the last one I've made, and it's uh, and I will continue to make them because uh, that's just who we are. You know, we're we're we do what we can do, but we make tough decisions sometimes, and they're they're the right ones sometimes, or the wrong ones sometimes. You got to live with it. Um, I lived with this one. I, I I regret it though. You know what I mean? It's one of my it's one of my regrets. Had I stayed, what would I still don't know if it would have, if I would have gotten any higher up the echelon. It's funny you say what would have UH happened. Outlaws. You became yeah. a Hall of Famer, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean that's that's a, that's another true statement about how blessed I am. Um, and, and look, I make no qualms about it. I got into the industry because my father and my brothers were wrestlers, and so I got a a, a leg up. You know, I got a foot in the door. Um, I'd like to think that I did my own work and I, and uh, and showed that work on a on a separate sheet of paper, um, so that I earned the spot I was given or the opportunities that I were given. But I don't know. You just do the best you can do and see what happens with it. You know. When you returned in '96, they showed a video of you singing in an empty arena. Was this your recording of the song from earlier in the day, or was this just something else? No, it was just something else. Like okay. literally, um, that was what we were gonna do. Was they were gonna show the rehearsal of me doing it, which was that. Um, and so we quit, and everything kind of went by the wayside. So, so uh, there's there's also always been a rumor that a second music video was gonna be done. Were you supposed to be the singer of that video? Do you remember? Yeah, yeah. So so look, I know we did sing one other song, uh, and I forget the name of it. And I forget how it goes, but I sang it at the at the slammies i want to say or the something like way back then and i sang a different song and i don't know what it was called now um but i sang it on stage and and all the boys the talent were all in there and stuff so yeah we were definitely going to do more music i mean that was the idea later in the show jeff defends the intercontinental title versus sean and of course you're at ringside and after a little mix-up you accidentally trip up jeff and it cost him the title Let's run this clip. We're very clip heavy today. I love it. Yeah. (laughs) Just the music every time. Music City USA. (laughs) You just heard the man. You just heard the man. Did you not? The World Wrestling Federation Intercontinental Champion today. Yeah. And he'll be the Intercontinental Heavyweight Champion tomorrow. <laughs> All right. <laughs> there ain't nothing all of you Nash billions or the heartbreak punk Sean Michaels Was this on the, can on the do pay per view? Did you see that sign at ringside? With it's my back to hard camera sure, the whole sure. time as I cut a <laughs> <laughs> A little hot, a little sweaty. Yes. Like, like what's debut. going on? Did they just send me out there to sp- spend some time or something? You know, he, Double J getting does some nothing. heat, building up. This was in your house. It was yeah. that intimate creation of bringing you into the arena if you were at home. There he comes. Double J, Jeff, Jerry. I'm not hearing a cheers. Oh, High cross body by Jared on Sean. Goes for the cover. Road Dog on the outside. Thinks he's got it Kick under. Out. No. No. Sean kicks out. Hey, this match was another banger, man. The timing with these two guys and and, uh, and just the, the kind chemistry. of. Chemistry. Yeah, the chemistry. The kind of the same mentality of that southern wrestler. Uh, <laughs> oh, and there's where it was. You thought it was Sean coming off. You end up tripping Jared into the super kick. Goes Jeff. He's dropped down for the three. Heartbreak Jeff. Kid gets the win. What did the roadie do? I pulled the wrong foot. You cost him the match. You cost him the championship. You cost him his career, dog. Jiminy Christmas. Uh, he cost me mine, too. We walked out right after that. <laughs> so. 
see right here I'm talking to him and I'm like and, and we were supposed to get up and he was gonna shove me and I was gonna knock him on his butt I believe that's that's what it was supposed to do and he said I'm rolling out of here and I said I'm rolling with you so, so the breakup left. was supposed to happen in the ring yes yes well it was supposed to be a punch the first we see the replay of the trip yeah, I had my back turned, so I didn't see. I love how Look, you I just, thought, I with thought the I fans, did the right thing. It's great, your reaction. It's just so confident. And there's trouble here at Nashville, Tennessee. There's trouble in there's Music trouble. City. There's trouble for sure. That's, there's the talk right there. And then Vince reports that something's going on backstage. You won't believe what just happened, Matt. I was standing here, and Double J came back, and he was mad. And then the roadie came back, and he was mad. And Double J, he yelled at the roadie. Then the roadie yelled at him. And Double J pushed the roadie. Then the roadie pushed Double J. Then they got each other's face. And then the roadie, he, he hit Double J. He knocked him down on his keys, <laughs> man. And then they went in his door. They won't let me in. You won't believe it. You would not believe the words coming out of their mouth. There is trouble in paradise. I'm telling you, many of you. They were at each other. I don't know what has happened. They have cut the cloth. I don't know, man. Back to you. I'll try to get more. I'll try. How much blow here. did Doc Hendricks <laughs> bump up his blowhole before delivering that pro? Uh, he was great. Look, Michael's great. Uh, blow or no blow, Michael's great. Um, that that was just amazingly over the top but exuberant that's what they, look, and excited that's what they were doing right it was like oh they didn't do our part we're gonna tell them that, that they did you know what i mean and that's that's smart on their behalf trying to clean up the mess that we we made you know the talent made so you had mentioned you, you knew you were walking out all day at this point so you knew that yep. was it yep Yep, I knew, and I knew I had a little money in the bank, and I knew, hey, this wrestling thing's easy. I made it right to the top in a year, and uh, it wasn't so easy after that. <laughs>